I am Ma'am Al Fatima Lima Peles. I will be your teacher for today's lesson. As you continue to grow and develop, it is important that you know how to manage the crucial aspect of your personality, your sexual health. This lesson will help you understand the concept gender and human sexuality. Now, let us have a short activity. How much do you know about gender and human sexuality? Find out by answering the following questions. Write your answers in your activity notebook. Number one question. What term defines a man or woman based on biological characteristics? A. Sex B. Gender C. Sexuality or D. Androgyny The answer is A. Sex Number two What do you call to the sets of activities that society considers as appropriate for men and women? A. Gender role B. Gender identity C. Gender equality or D. Gender sensitivity The answer is B. Gender identity Number 3. Why is it important to understand human sexuality? A. We will be all mature adults B. We have similar sexuality issues C. There is a specific age for developing one sexuality or D. It will help us build a better relationship with ourselves and others. The answer is D. It will help us build a better relationship with ourselves and others. Number 4. A social concept on how men and women should think, feel, and act. It refers to femininity or masculinity of a person's role and behavior. A. Human sexuality B. Gender role C. Gender or D. Sex The answer is C. Gender Number 5. It is an integral part of what we do and who we are. It is the way in which we experience and express ourselves as sexual beings. It is the total expression of an individual's self-concept. A. Sexuality B. Gender identity C. Gender equality or D. Sex The answer is A. Sexuality Today, let us have a discussion about gender and human sexuality. Are you ready? Let's go! Let's define sex. Sex is a major aspect of personality. It is closely related to emotional and social development and can be best understood by connecting it to the total adjustment of individuals in family and society. The purpose of gender and human sexuality education is to promote wholesome family and interpersonal relationships. It aims to provide you with knowledge and skills needed to establish and practice helpful behaviors. Sexuality refers to your total self. Sexuality involves the physical, mental, social, emotional, and ethical dimensions of one's personality. Physical self, the way you look as a man or woman. Mental self, the way you think as a man or woman. Social self, the way you interact with others. Emotional self, the way you feel about yourself and others. Ethical self, the way you value relationships. 
it is important to have a clear outlook of yourself, then you will be able to focus on your points and work on your weaknesses. If you know yourself well, you will know what you must do to stay healthy. Activity 1. The Wonder of Me Read and analyze how the author expresses herself. The Wonder of Me by Bernadette Borja Rosa Rosso Look at me in the eyes. Tell me who am I. Think of me just like you are, as I take you as mine. Gaze into my innermost world. You learn who I am. Interact with me and acquire a little of myself. Feel my soul and together we'll discover each other's world. Answer the following questions. Write your answer in your activity notebook. Number one, how do you express yourself? Number two, how do you see yourself? Number three, how much do you know yourself? And number four, how much others know yourself? Sexuality means you have to be aware of yourself better. As you grow older, you will experience a range of social, emotional, and physical changes. As this occur, you need an intensive knowledge on how to deal with your attitudes and behavior. The way you see yourself is influenced by many people. It is important to maintain a good relationship with others. They will support you and give you confidence, provide companionship, and keep you from being lonely. Healthy sexuality encompasses the following characteristics. Self-love, your acceptance of yourself. Self-knowledge, your understanding of your feelings and characters. Self-confidence, your awareness of the things that you can do well. Self-respect, your regard for yourself as a worthwhile person. Self-expression, your way of showing your individuality and expressing yourself as a man or woman. Bear in mind that learning human sexuality is important because of the following. 1. It teaches you that giving and receiving love is a human need. Number 2. It helps you appreciate your sexual identity. Number 3. It makes you respect your own and other's body. Number 4. It makes you experience body changes and learn how to properly manage these changes. Number five, it helps you appreciate how life began. And last, it provides you with information on how to be disease-free and how to live a healthy lifestyle. Sex is the biological basis of being a male or female. Gender is a social concept on how men and women should think, feel, and act. It refers to the femininity or masculinity of a person's role and behavior. Gender equality permits men and women equal enjoyment of human rights. Gender role refers to the set of roles characteristics and expectations of how men and women should feel, think, and act as influenced by parents. Sexuality is an integral part of what we do and who we are. It is the way in which we experience and express ourselves as sexual beings. It is the total expression of an individual's self-concept. Think back on something that you have learned from this video. Reflect on the following questions and then write your answers in your activity notebook. Number one, what did you learn? Number two, 
How did you go about learning the lesson? Number three, why did you choose to learn it? Number four, what or who helped you learn it? Cheers!